Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and this is probably going to be my favorite video yet. This is what happens when you don't aren't on for 83 or more days. I'm literally attacking my own village. This is insane, and I love that Supercell added this. It's one, it's amazing how you can attack your own base, and it just adds a little bit of storyline to Clash of Clans because it's mostly just a free game of it, or free to play game, other than the intro. It doesn't really have many storyline. But now, with this, and also reinforcements at the top, we get reinforcements so we don't lose. That's pretty smart from Supercell as well, so. But it's crazy how this, I'm attacking my old village. I played Clash of Clans till like, since like 2013 or 2014, and it has just gone so so much from where it started and now to be attacking my own village this is just amazing i don't know i just feel like it's amazing just a huge step for supercell and i think it's an awesome thing for clash clans to be doing and it's really also just interesting and a part of the storyline but here we almost defeated our own base and we just did and we used a lot more troops than we can hold and more storyline. Okay, so there's a lot of new stuff we need to see. First of all, 4 million gold? That is so much for a loot cart. Jeez. And then all, all, wait, that, so normally you aren't allowed to have league things, but apparently they updated it so you can have league rewards but for lower town halls you just can't buy, buy the gold pass which is i think really smart by supercell so people don't get super op if they buy the pass when they're in like tunnel six but they can still get some small rewards as a bonus but wow this is i've never seen anything like this laboratory is bustling with activity finished up available so it upgraded my archers, wizards, goblins. So everything is uh, upgraded in my laboratory. This is gonna make maxing out my rush to, or not my rush to max base, my let's play base a lot easier and going to town hall six a lot easier. Okay, that is a lot of stuff. Five elixir collectors, five elixir collectors, all my gold mines, all my storages, all my barracks, all my archer towers. All, this is crazy how it just maxed out my whole base for me. And I think for the most part, it's amazing, but they could, they might have gone a bit too far with the builders. But that's my overview on what happens when you aren't active on your base for 83 days. Hope you like it, and thank you for watching.